Hello everyone, welcome to Equity's Architect. Today I am going to explore Raspberry Pi camera module with Raspberry Pi 0W. So, no more waiting, let's start. Now, it's time to explore the Raspberry Pi 0W camera connector. And here it is. You can visualize the camera connectivity port of Raspberry Pi 0W. Fine. Next, we are going to connect the Pi module camera with 0W. But, 0W supports only 22 pin camera cable. In this Pi module, we have 15 pin camera cable. We need to change the camera cable to connect it with the Pi 0W. So, let's change the camera cable. Right now, I have 22 pin camera cable. So, let's replace the 15 pin cable. It's quite simple. To change the camera cable, you need to pull the connector towards downside. Okay. Now, it's done. Next, insert the 22 pin camera cable. I have inserted the 22 pin cable in the camera module. So, let's close the connector. Now, it's complete. It's time to connect the camera module with Raspberry Pi 0W. Let's follow the process. To open the camera connector, just pull it towards downside. Next, insert the cable and close the connector. The setup is complete. The camera module successfully inserted into the Raspberry Pi 0W board. Now it's time to power on the Raspberry Pi 0W. So the LED is blinking and Raspberry Pi 0W is ready to boot. Now it's time to access the Raspberry Pi 0W system through VNC remote desktop viewer. Yes, the Raspberry Pi system is right now ready. So, we are going to test the Pi camera module. Before checking the connectivity, we need to change the Raspberry Pi settings. By default, the camera module is disabled. Okay, so we are going to change it. Now, open the Raspberry Pi settings. By default, the camera connectivity is disabled in Raspberry Pi operating system. To enable the camera settings, go to the interface options. And here, the legacy camera we need to enable. So, select the option and hit enter. Now, here in my system, it's enabled. Okay, but by default, it's disabled. So, you need to enable the camera support. Yes, enter and it's done. So, right now, the camera settings successfully enabled for my system. Now, it's time to check the Pi camera module. All the settings are in place. We are ready to test the Pi camera module. So, why are you waiting? Let's do it. Now, I am creating a new directory to store all the images in the defined directory. To capture an image from the terminal, we need to use the command raspi still. Next, we are going to save the image with the name test.jpg. But before that, I am going to test it with the ls command to check if the file is created or not. Yes, test.jpg is right now available. Okay, let's go to the picture folder. Okay. Now, yes, test.jpg created. 
let's capture another image and it's done After capturing the still images, it's time to record a video using Pi camera module. Here we are going to record a video using the command raspi vid and the file name is sample.h264. So this is the video file extension. So let's start. Go to, let's go to the file explorer and check the video captured by Pi camera module.